In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to delete a colour from your library in Figma. If you've ever found yourself with a colour style you no longer need or simply want to tidy up your design system, this guide is for you. We'll walk through the process step by step, making it straightforward and easy to follow whether you're a seasoned Figma user or just starting out. First off, you'll want to open your web browser and navigate to Figma's website. Figma is a powerful collaborative interface design tool used by designers around the world, helping teams create everything from simple graphics to complex web and mobile designs. Once you're on the Figma homepage, you'll need to log into your account. If you don't have an account yet, you'll need to sign up, but for today's purposes, I'll assume you already have one and are ready to go. After logging in, you'll find yourself on the Figma home screen. This is your central hub where you can manage your files and access different projects. From here, we need to go to the design interface. Look for the option labeled home and click on it. This will bring you to your main workspace where you'll be able to access all the files and tools you need for your project. Within the workspace, you'll want to locate and click on the design section. This is where you can browse your design files and manipulate different elements. Once you have your design file open, identify the object or component whose colour you wish to change. Within the right sidebar, you should see several options detailing the properties of the selected element. Focus your attention on the fill section in this sidebar. Clicking fill will display all the colour options applied to your selected element. Within this pop-out, you'll see an array of solid and gradient colours, each corresponding to a part of your design. For those who often work with colour styles, this section will be familiar territory. Next, locate the custom option within the fill menu. The custom button lets you alter specific colour properties, giving you the flexibility to tweak hues and styles. Clicking on custom opens a detailed panel with more options and sliders. Here you can modify colour attributes or remove them entirely. To delete a colour style, you'll first need to identify the colour you no longer want in your palette. Once located, an option should be available to delete or remove it from the library. This might involve right-clicking the swatch or selecting a trash bin icon, depending on Figma's latest interface updates. And there you have it. Now you've successfully deleted a colour from your Figma library. By keeping your colour palette organised, you maintain a streamlined workflow and more efficient design process. Thanks for joining me today. I hope you found this tutorial helpful, and if you have any more questions or need further assistance, don't hesitate to reach out in the comments below. Happy designing!